when you did the scene about the washerwomen down in the river and you had that big wool fl- frock on and you went down there to uh and we'll show obviously we'll show pictures of that and you went to the river it looks like it looked like you were going to die when you walked into that <laughs> river because <laughs> you were illustrating how dangerous everyday jobs were right and one of those jobs is being a washer person going to the river and washing in those big thick wool clothes what was that experience like yeah and in fact it would have been any woman because well of a certain I mean, not of high ranks but pretty much every woman who had to wash their own clothes and most clothes were linen and wool and we were filming it in may but as you may know the uk can have weather in may that is like someone else's february so we it was really cold and um so we went in to see you know how dangerous it was because the wall gets very quickly full of water and becomes very very heavy and it really does right? it really does there's no kidding going on there at all so it was just sort of one of those experimental things i mean there were people nearby like i wasn't going to die but it was you know just push can do you think you could try a bit more do you think you could give it another go and i sort of like <laughs> um and it and also because we didn't have huge numbers of changes of clothes. So um, I basically had to go for it because otherwise you would have noticed the clothes were wet before I went into the water. You know, that's <laughs> a continuity thing. So I kind of had to, I just had to do it and see what happened. It's kind of funny you say that because I did notice there was a quick edit because you were in the river in this in that dress and you're like, oh, I feel like it's taking my breath away. And then the next thing I know, you're on the you're on the um, bank. And you're talking, I'm like, oh, I bet the people went in there and said, okay, okay, Susanna, that's yeah, enough. Yeah, we got you. Yeah, too dangerous now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> was that the most dangerous you did when you were talking about the dangers? Well, funny enough, so I was filming, I had a wonderful um, director for that, and she was, um, I don't know, she had a sort of slightly sadistic streak, I'm sure she won't mind me <laughs> saying, because the other thing I did with her was for that series was actually felt more dangerous at the time was that we were testing out uh, a woman's lung capacity when wearing a corset. Yes, and I saw the that. the interesting thing is it does reduce your lung capacity by, by, by about a quarter. So you suddenly understand all those faintings and all that type of thing. Anyway, so to test this, uh, I went up and down stairs, first not wearing the corset and then wearing the corset. And of course, the, the, the stupid thing that I did was that when I did the first kind of like the control and I just trotted up the stairs and back down again, I did it at far too fast a pace. <laughs> and so then I had to keep, and they were like, now you need to keep that pace up. I was like, uh, oh, really? <laughs> anyway, so then I was, had to recreate that pace when I was wearing the corset. And there was a moment when I was doing the corset uh, steps up and down. I can't remember how many times I had to do it. But it was like for a good number of minutes and I remember thinking I am going to faint and I'm going to fall down the stairs and they're just going to keep on filming <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to fall and break something and it's going to make great TV <laughs> it's going to be great content yeah, yeah. Hey, thanks for watching and or listening. And if you want to catch all the latest updates, uh, make sure you bang on that subscribe button.